this was the watermelon that started off with the 511 fish fertilizer in the soil. And it's in a much richer soil also. There's actually little uh, flowers in there. I don't know if you can see them. There's two. And I have put the vines back in in here many, many times. This is the one that did not start off with 511. Well, actually they both did and I moved it. So this soil doesn't have it buried in it. And it's fertilized regularly, but it's in more of a mulch getting really hard to keep those in the pot. I have to constantly turn those little vines around and put them back in the dirt. <laughs> I definitely have to come out here and weed again. It, it rained a couple of days ago and that's all it took. This whole area was clear, cleared out. But uh, yeah, so anyway, if you can't see it, um, the melon, um, there's two of them that are out here still. Um, and it's got one little trail and one main little area right there where it's coming out. And then, next time I come, I come out here with the camera, I will have definitely uh, trimmed this back. See that? That's it. And then it's got a little right there. Now I've actually moved the vines back into the containers a couple of times and every time I turn a vine back in and circle it in and push it into the substrate, it kicks out another vine. This is the one that's in basically mulch and fertilizer and it's trailing out the other side. I don't know if you can see down there. That's a melon, and it's got some little uh, poofies, melon poofies, <laughs> on there also. Now this one here, the one that's in the more rich soil, it's actually looks like they're about to touch and choke each other off. It's already begun. Look at that. They're holding hands. Oh my gosh, they're holding hands. So anyway, yeah, it's going that direction and uh, hopefully it'll go onto the... Last, last summer, we actually had a melon coming out of here, right out of here. We had a watermelon. Um, somebody had just, you know, spit a seed out. And the watermelon came up right there. This is a Batik Samara melon. It's in a bucket. It's actually four of them. And we're going to put them out in the garden in a little bit. So that they can vine out and not mix with these. these leaves are compared to these that are thinner, more skeletal. Lots of flowers on them. There's a little melon growing. Look at that. That's actually about the size of a softball right now. And then the other one that's in richer soil has several. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight vines coming out of it versus three coming out of this one. 
this is the first one. That's out here in the dirt. And you can see it's got a got a little baby down there. It's also got another one that's bigger. The ones in the garden um, took off a lot slower, and that's the ones that made it anyway, took off a lot slower. But yeah, this one's got a melon, and yeah, those are them.